Welcome back to the Fire Dash Pokemon Vanguard. In the last episode, we finally got the this town right here, the Taurus the, uh, District, and we're going to try to find our rivals, see what's going on, and join the tournament potentially. But as I stated in the previous video, because I'm doing a book recording, occasionally I'm sure many of you've seen that my video desynced after a while. So if you guys know how to resync the audio and the video together for the full video. Let me know in the comments section. I do a, I have a Victus laptop, Intel Core i5. Um, but yeah, if anyone knows, if you're game savvy, you're tech savvy, software savvy, let me know, and hopefully I can continue do better on this playthrough, future playthroughs, past playthroughs, etc., etc. But let's talk to Rylus here. That's not the talk button. What you reading, Rylus? Nothing. I thought this place might have something interesting. It turns out it's pretty much the same books we have back at Vanguard. Anyway, what are you two doing here in Arlen? Are you also volunteering at the Ranger Station? No, we are invited to participate in the Arlen Tournament. You and everyone else, it seems. This city has been flocking with a lot from more trainers than usual. Bold of us to assume we were special for getting picked up. Well, I guess we'll find out during check-in tomorrow. By the way, in a few hours. Did you two want to join Calvin and I later at the coffee shop next door? Oh, we were actually going to ask you the same thing, but I guess he got to you first. Right. I guess I'll see you in a few hours then. Let us go get Zeke. I forgot, are there, encounter there are encounters here. So let us turn off the repel. Nope, not that way. This way. Then let us go up. Well, that's where we want to go. Encounters go. Hello. I told you already, Colin. No matter how much you bury your head in those books, you're nothing without actual training. I never really liked the idea of battling a Tom Stronger, but I guess you're right. I probably should get some on field training. But before the room begins. Both of you too soon when we get past the first round. Wow. You sound kind of like your brother with that statement. What did you- Hey, hey, calm down. Zeke can be pretty angry at times, but it's not nearly as unbearable as his brother's ego. <sighs> I suppose you're right. I promised Marshall I'd help him study battle strategies. Hopefully you come to our training session tomorrow too. Yeah, we'll see. What up, Zeke? You don't need really Got intimidated. Bad. What up? Huh? What the hell the hell are you doing here? Calvin, Destiny, and I were invited to participate in the Arlen tournament. I assume you're here for the same reason. Yeah, all my pre academy classmates did as well. No. Oh. Well Calvin asked if he wanted to meet with him at the coffee shop down the road later. We were going to I don't have time for anything like that. I need to prepare for this tournament. See you around. Well, rude. Huh, well that went as expected. If there's anything else cool here. That is a Rattata. Not interested. Holy fuck. Not interested. The one little pet peeve I do have is that the level caps are so close together. Oh, let's actually do this uh, quest real quick. Per level, not bad. Oh, what was I saying? The level caps per each chapter are like very close, so like you'll like never see a big jump in levels, which isn't bad, but it kind of makes it boring at times. Hi, Pidgey. Bye, Pidgey. So it's dead in there. Pat Rat, no, thank you. Nothing there. 
Give me a zigzag zoom. You are adorable. Ooh, a ribbon. Okay. Let's give it a shot. Vivian, Vivian, and Vivian. Level 25. Oh boy. Oh, easy. Dragon one. Let's take out that one. Didn't take that. That's unfortunate. Well, that did not. Too good. Wow. Really, they do not like my clutching thing, which is understandable. I should take out that one. Special nice candy stuff. Hey, so the den was the only thing there. Just run away. Entrance is there. Hello. Nah. That's annoying. That is a gloom. Not interested in a gloom. Oh, hello. Okay. Is that all of them? Nope, still one more missing. Item. I will happily take the item. Ultra Ball, nice. Fat rat, no, thank you. Um, what's the Sigma? Whoa! That duo looks sick! Yeah, 
He has like a little sword, I love that. That was pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. Hurtier. Intimidate and level 14. Wow, you are low level, my dude. I guess this is like a side thing to do to get some extra levels, I guess. Oh, you're cute. Tina looks sick, but I I'm loving uh, Swalu right now. Butterfree, uh, that one, of course. Twenty three. You need to chill. Actually, my best bet right now. You have protect. Now, let's speed this up a little bit. Oh, this is going to be annoying. Buskin.
I do agree. Hey, Max survive yes please. Cyclops is so big! And another train. Of course! You dare disturb my meditation? Yes, yes I do. Please hit yourself. Lots and dirt coming in clutch right now. Let's go to Growlithe. Speeded this up because the stranger's becoming a pain in the ass. Wake up. Wake up! more candies. I will take that. Ultra Ball. Nice. That's more points. Let's go. No, we can't go that way. Yep, nope. I am not ready for this. Nope, nope, nope. Really? Platinum or higher? So, nope. Just want to get this pooch and this lily pup, like my lord. Oh, you don't want to battle.
There he is. Woo! That's a lot of money. Let's go this way, let's go to the cafe. I'll definitely go in there again afterwards, but I kind of want to make the story progress. Just a little bit. That'd be nice. Yeah, it's yours. Heal me, please. Zeke did show up. <clears throat> Alright, I lived in this city my whole life, so I pretty much know just about everything there is to know. First things first, the metro system is easily the quickest way around. One ride is 200, but you can buy a permanent pass for 3k at the Pokemon. Number two, Arlen has a bit of crime problem, but most of the gangs have been driven into hiding. What petty crimes would be any match for us? I mean, maybe they could be Rylas, but definitely not me. You're still not over me kicking your ass in Sylvan. <clears throat> Nevertheless, you should be always be on guard. And finally, stay away from anyone with wearing a green coat and hat. They work for the Sedona's company and they take their job way too seriously. Those bastards will pick a fight with you for pretty much anything. Anyway, you guys have a place to stay for the week, right? Uh, no. <laughs> are there any hotels around here we could stay at? Definitely not in this district. Those are all packed. There's one in the Northern District that's pretty affordable. No use. I checked the line earlier. They're packed. Same with, well, every affordable hotel in Ireland. We really suck at planning things. Just whatever. We can probably find something outside the city. But that'll be super inconvenient. Huh? My phone. Oh, hey, Mom. Oh, that sucks. Wait, really? Yay, thank you, Mom. I love you, too. Oh, that's adorable. What was that about? <laughs> come on, spit it out. Well, my mom can't come to see the tournament like she originally planned, but she changed our hotel reservation to my name. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, but what about us? She said the room was big enough for four people, so I suppose you guys could come too. Thank goodness. What hotel did she say it was? The Sedona's Hotel? Oh shit, that's right down the block from my apartment building. Yay, we're all pretty close then. Let's all head over there now. Where is the hotel? Oh wait, I know where it is. Isn't it... Here? Aha! Nope, not there. So I guess we gotta take a the metro. the hotel now.
is the hotel. Oh, is this it? Grand Hotel. There we go. This is our hotel. Wow. This place is really pretty. How the hell did your mother afford this place? Ahem. <clears throat> Are you only here to shout, or do you actually have rooms booked? Oh, right. Checking for Destiny Rosera? Let's see. Ah, room 3B. Here are your keys, miss. Thank you. Alright, everyone, let's go! Wow, this place is pretty big. Pretty cool, right? Yeah, thank God your mom came through for us. How the hell did she even afford this? Three bedroom hotel here is at least 1200k a night. And for nine days. Are your parents rich or something? No, my mom works your average office job. So I guess I'm just as confused. Maybe your mom has a sugar daddy? Rylas! I, I, I was only joking. Also, Zeke, shouldn't you be used to this kind of life? The hell is that supposed to mean? I mean, your dad is Zachary Iska. I'm sure he made a shit ton of money. Uh... Your dad's a Grandmaster Trainer? I suppose it's only a matter of time before you all found out, but... Yeah... But yeah, my old man is technically one of the strongest trainers in the region. That's so cool, if you say so. But no, Rallis, despite what he makes, he was pretty adamant about giving us a pretty normal life without tons of money thrown at it. Hmm, that's a shame. I was going to ask you to buy me something nice. And why the hell would I do that even with a million dollars? I don't know. It would be good practice for being nice to women. I don't need to hear that from you. Yawn. Listen to you two bickers making me tired. Anyway, I was thinking, since there's only three rooms, Rylas and I could share the center room. Sounds good to me. The farthest away from this nerd, the better. Alright then, see you two tomorrow. Island City, day two. Hey, you can't just barge in here. Oh boy. Hi! You must be Destiny. I heard so much about you from the. Huh? What's all the. Uh, commotion? Oh, and you are. Someone who belongs in this room, unlike you. Ooh, you're Rylas. Yep, the sass checks out. What? Hey, like I said, you can't just barge in here like that. And the last one to the right is. Fire! I heard you're pretty strong. We should train. Hello? Are you deaf? Like Destiny said, you can't just barge in here uninvited. Don't waste your breath. Zeke! I know I'd find you here. Everyone, this is Laura Kodosta, the princess of the Kodosta Company. Hey, I'm not the one who takes a squad of bodyguards everywhere I go. Alright, that's your sister. Yeah, I actually know how to defend myself. That's because no one of actual strength ever tried to attack you? What's that supposed to mean? Look at yourself. I, I wouldn't guess you were the daughter of the richest man in the region. <laughs> Joke's on you. I can actually take that as a compliment. Anyway, did you guys want to come to train at the park with Zeke and I? Uh, sure. I guess. I remember agreeing to this. Yay, come to the park down the block then. Well, she's quite the character, alright? Wait a second. She forgot to invite Rylas. It's fine. I was planning on doing something on my own today anyways. Plus, she didn't really seem my type of person anyway. Oh, alright. Well, I guess we'll see you later then. Oof. That's gotta suck. Locked. One. And off we go. Oop. What's over here? Oh, jeez. Where's the entrance? There it is. Hello. 
You think just because we're in a city you're safe from Pokemon battles? Yes, yes I did. Ah, the duos. Can I heal by the way? I am. Nice! Uh, wig attack! Get right. Earlier, buskin. Double kick. Even with the intimidate, you're about to get wrecked, Zun. Double kick. That's disappointing. And good encounter. Titum. All right, hello you three. It's time for a little super duper awesome training session. Oh boy. Hey, if you got a compliment, you better share with the whole class. That's what I thought. Anyways, besides me is my trusty friend Colin. Hello. He'll be in charge of rating our performance while you face off against me. Should I grade your performance as well? I appreciate the offer, but I think I'll bore you with my perfect scores. If you say so. Alright, who wants to go first? I'll go- Zeke? Yay! Thank you for volunteering. I didn't even say anything, damn it. Don't you remember what I said about your outbursts? Whoa. Alright, Zeke. Come on up. Whoa, you've gotten a lot stronger, obviously. Hmm. 68%. Your lead provides zero setup for the rest of the fight. And your fourth one would have lasted way longer if you hadn't gone full on aggressive. What does it matter? I won, didn't I? You won a battle. Just one. If more opponents came at you, there would be a significant higher chance in your defeat due to your lack of Pokemon. You already have ready to fight. Psst. Now you just sound like my instructor. Well, Zeke, you tried. But I. Next man, next up, Destiny! The stage is yours, girl. Introduce yourself. Um, my name is Destiny Rosa. I'm from Ohoshia. I'm here to represent Vanguard Academy. Hmm. Five out of ten. Massive lack of self confidence. I thought I was doing great. Battle time! Ooh, an interesting approach. Yet yeah, something fell off. You had a strong start, but around half of you started to panic as your strategy fell apart. Got your enemy, that behavior can endanger you and even your allies. 57%. Aw, I thought I would do better than that. But you can, and you will. But for now, just focus on your confidence. Uh, Alright. But for now, our big finale. Fire! From what I've heard, you're personally selected by the head of Vanguard Academy to attend your school. On top of that, you pass your bronze exam with astounding numbers. Let's see what you got. Version. Oh yeah, that's fair. He's level 22. Yeah, that's so good. Did you have to take out? Ow! The the dunce bars. Ow. That's 
go. Got the poison. Let's heal up from Buskin just in case. Buskin. And slip strike. Let's go. This is actually kind of tough. I excuse me. What? I, I got stumped? No, you did not. You put work in. 73%. Laurel, didn't you say I was getting paid for this? Yeah, yeah, I'll get to it eventually. But this is just the beginning, so let's keep going. Ah, well that was fun. Maybe for you, I'm exhausted. Yeah, that was tough. You couldn't have even given us a break in between. Real Pokemon trainers don't get breaks. Yes, they... Yes, they do. Well, you get your break now. Head home for today. We'll begin again tomorrow. Ah, this feeling again. I keep forgetting I don't belong here. But I like it here, at least for the time being. So I'll keep, keep going. Running away won't get any me anywhere. Morning already? Wow, you slept like a baby after that training yesterday. Well, we get a head start on the day. Maybe I can sneak out before Laurel shows up at my front door. It's kind of cool how they make it where you're kind of under the sheets. Focus gear. Oh, we are definitely changing that ringtone later. Text from Calvin. Yo, fire. I got a precise help request from the Ranger Center. Mind helping me out? Meet me on Route 6. Thanks. Ask 
me for help, then gives me the location before I said yes. Sounds about right. Well, I guess I can't complain. It'll probably be more fun than Laurel's training. Round 6 should be right down the road. Down. Should be right down the down from here. What? <laughs> Probably there. Yeah, let's check it out. Oh. Fire! What? Oh, hi. <laughs> so about my texts. Apparently woman on this route was attacked by wild Pokemon. Alright, that does sound too out of the ordinary. Not that I don't mind helping you, but isn't this something you could take care of on your own? Well, that's a, there's a catch, sort of. The request feels super strange. Who reported it? Why didn't they help the wind right away there? And if they were unable to, why not come to alert the rangers immediately? Instead of leaving a help request. Exactly. So what do you think? You think it could be a trap? Something along those lines. No offense, but that seems pretty unlikely. What idiot would try to ambush a Pokemon ranger? Yeah, I know. But I'd still like someone to have my back, just in case. Fair enough. Lead the way. All right. Another data cable. What are these for? Like, if you watched up to this point, let me know what the data the cable does, because I'm just finding so many. Ooh. I did. Oh, I am not healed. Would've been nice if I got healed after that battle, like, good lord. You know, I think this is a good spot to wrap up. In the next episode, we'll see what's going on with Calvin's help out. And then maybe get to the tournament? Maybe? But I like this team right now. Actually, before... Did I do well? I did. So I have 16 more. No, we'll make them 80. Let us... Bump up the attack a little bit. So we bumped up the IVs a little bit, but I think that's a good spot to wrap up. In the next episode, we'll help out Calvin, see what's going on, and see if we can make more progress to the story. 
Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to smash that like button and subscribe if you're enjoying the playthrough. And remember what I said before, let me know what's going on, why my audio desyncs at times, it resyncs, it starts off good, then ends up bad. Uh, if you guys know, let me know in the comments. That'd be greatly appreciated as well. I'm hopefully bring you guys more enjoyment for my videos as well. But I will see you guys in the next episode.